Shalom, my name is Michael Decker and I'm a lawyer within the law offices of Coin Decker, Fex and Broch. Today I wanted to discuss a very simple matter um, and it's regarding visa runs. Um, visa run is basically a term that was more or less made up by, by many Israel lovers that visit Israel a lot and uh, that more or less live here but do not have uh, residency or citizenship and they basically live here on a tourist visa, a B2 tourist visa and uh, in order to maintain their center of life here they have to do what's called visa runs, quote unquote. So a visa run is usually uh, visiting a close country to Israel such as Jordan, Egypt, Cyprus, Turkey and basically it's called a visa run because you want run quickly to a border country and return to Israel and a tourist from a country that has a visa relationship with Israel and particularly like a western country that's well off um, where there is usually no fear of a settlement of a country of a citizen of a country like that in Israel such as the United States, Australia and so on and so forth um, a citizen like that would usually easily get a three months visa here in Israel and then he would after the three months ends or right before the three months ends leave and then come back for another three months leave and come back for another three months and there are people that actually lived in Israel for decades like this had a house had a life had kids had families and everything and more or less lived in the country this way um, lately, I would say in the last decade, Israel started buckling down on this phenomenon um, and Israel started preventing these visa runs. So uh, basically there is an internal guideline, it's not a written policy, whereby the interior ministry um, uh, decided that uh, people can live in Israel on tourist visas or visit on tourist visas for no more than between three to six months. Um, and if the interior ministry uh, has indications that uh, um, uh, these people basically are living here and not just touring here, uh, many times uh, such tourists are, uh, are being denied entry into the country. And, and some of these tourists have been uh, doing these visa runs for many, many, many years. So it's very surprising, of course, to them that all of a sudden their entry is being denied and refused even though they never overstayed their visa, even though they never... Um, resided here illegally um, and and the essential logic which does make sense by the way is that on a tourist visa you're not allowed to live here you're allowed to visit um, and visa runs are basically more or less living here however even today there are people that are living here on visa runs um, and this is still going on and others um, maybe less fortunate are being denied entry and deported so in any case our office deals with many cases like this and if you're a lover of Israel and love visiting and you have been denied entry, you can feel free to contact us and we'll be happy to represent you and assist you with overturning any decision of denying your entry. Um, so please feel free to contact us. Thank you for your time.